It was October 31, 1942. The world was engulfed in the chaos of World War II. But as bombs fell, factories roared, and soldiers marched into battle, a quieter holiday was stirring across towns and villages. Halloween was coming, and even amidst war, people found ways to celebrate. Rationing was in full effect. Sugar, metal, rubber, even fabric was hard to come by. Costumes became a creative endeavor. Families reused old clothes, repurposed sheets, and turned whatever they could find into makeshift disguises. With sugar heavily rationed, treats were scarce. Instead of candies, children received homemade cookies, apples, or popcorn balls when they went trick or treating. And sometimes, they simply did without. Across the United States, Halloween became more than just a night of ghosts and goblins. It was a chance to support the troops. Communities hosted Halloween parties that doubled as war bond drives. Families donated their extra coins, bought bonds, and used Halloween as a chance to rally together in the spirit of patriotism. Halloween parades were a popular sight in small towns and big cities alike. But instead of spooky themes, they often featured floats with patriotic symbols. Even as families kept one eye on the radio for news from the front, they celebrated Halloween, not just as a holiday, but as a reminder that there would be a future, a future worth fighting for.